Phytech is helping the world's top growers optimize their production while saving water, energy, and labor, based on direct data from their plants, the soil, and the weather. In this video, we'll walk through our Pivot app, the most advanced irrigation management solution for row crops and the first tool to integrate direct plant and soil moisture data. The result? Growers get unprecedented monitoring and prediction abilities together with clear AI-based recommendations. Let's see how it works. At the core of Phytech's solution is the plant. By placing sensors directly on the plant and translating the raw data via algorithm, we know its water demand, health, and growth rate. We call this plant status. A simple color-coded indicator where red means the plant entered water stress and green means it is happy and has enough water. The black line on the color bar gives you a clear understanding of your plant status and how far it is from stress levels. If the plant stress is increasing, the arrow attached to the black line will point left. And if the plant stress is decreasing, the arrow will point right. All current plant statuses on your farm are visible near the top of the screen, together with the water drop icon indicating how many pivots are operating. For the first time in the history of agriculture, plants can communicate their needs, and growers are able to listen and irrigate exactly according to their demand. We're also monitoring the exact location of the pivot and how much water has been delivered, as represented by the blue line on the perimeter and the amount of water being applied. The brown bar on the left represents your soil moisture level, generated by soil probe readings from six different depths, and the plant dynamic refill line. Are you thinking about a regular refill line? Think again. Unlike most soil moisture solutions that have a predetermined refill line, our patented algorithm recalibrates the refill line according to the plant status so it keeps getting better and more field-specific over time. For example, if the plants are telling us that they have enough water to withstand soil moisture depletion while staying stress-free and happy, the refill line will adjust downward accordingly, giving you more days until you need to fill the soil to avoid stress. We also use a machine learning algorithm to predict the soil moisture depletion rate to tell you how many days you have until the moisture level drops below the refill line, so you can plan accordingly. On the main screen's right side are the water balance bars. The bottom one showing past irrigation performance, and the upper bar is what you should expect in the next seven days. The blue color represents the delivered quantity. The turquoise is rainwater, and the black line represents Phytech's irrigation recommendation. On the next seven days bar, the black line represents the referenced plant demand for the next seven days, and the blue color represents the pivot water capacity, the amount of water that will be given by the pivot if it runs for the next seven days. In case you need further support in your decision-making, we've added a bottom line, which is specific to the current date and location. The advisor generates its daily recommendations based on the following parameters. Plant data, soil moisture level and prediction, climate forecast, crop phenological stage, and pivot watering capacity. Now, let's see how the app helps the grower in real life. In this example, the plant status is green, meaning the plant is happy and has enough water. The pivot is not irrigating, and the grower is probably considering when to start. Looking at the soil moisture bar, he notices he's only two days above the plant dynamic refill line, and checking the weather widget, he notices a coming heat wave. By observing these three data points, the plant, the soil, and the weather, he should consider irrigating. A quick look at the advisor tells you just that. Consider another common scenario and how the app facilitates decision-making. In this example, the color is yellow, meaning stress is developing. The pivot is not irrigating. Looking at the soil moisture bar, our grower notices that he's only one day above the plant dynamic refill line, and the forecast tells him that rain is not in sight. The plant dynamic refill line, together with the mild stress, indicate that irrigation is needed. And again, the advisor tells you just that. 
Growers who want to deep dive and get an even better understanding of their plants can click on the Pivot Circle, which will open the Pivot's card. At the top, you can review historical and current weather at the chosen location. The blue line represents how much time the Pivot operated, and the location icon represents the specific time the Pivot was over the location and how much water has been delivered. Clicking a location will open a summary of the irrigation event. The colored bar represents the plant status so you can know how the plants are doing. On the lower part, the soil's profile data is presented. Switch between seeing all the measurements in the profile to explore questions such as how deep did the irrigation go into the soil or whether some of the water penetrated below the root zone. Toggling to the root zone view, you can see the average soil moisture in the current root zone and compare it to the plant dynamic refill line. If the soil moisture falls beneath the plant dynamic refill line, the probability of plant stress increases dramatically. You can easily switch between different time views, daily, weekly, or for the entire season by clicking the filter icon at the bottom right corner. Clicking the leaf icon will upload the plant's growth and MDS graphs. A positive growth represents vegetative development in the plant, and the MDS correlates to the daily water demand level. Finally, let's go over other features and settings. Clicking the information icon on the top will give you the pivot's rain gauge, GPM, crop, and soil type for each location. Back on the main screen, you can choose to see all your crops or just one of them. You can also change the way the pivots are presented by sorting according to plant status, name, or crop type. On the setting screen, you can change the water pressure unit system, the plant stress notifications, and activate the colorblind mode. That's it! You're good to grow! For more information and videos, visit us at www.phytech.com.